Okay, in this video, we're going to look at uh, how to use ClientMate for Windows to perform safe shutdown of your computer over a network connected to a networking card, SNMP card, inserted in a PowerShield UPS. Okay, so basically all you have to do is go and open ClientMate, and I have already installed ClientMate in my Windows 7 operating system, so let's go down the taskbar and do that. So if I just click on him, okay, ClientMate will open up. Now, the first thing we'll do is it will you will be presented with the main menu. So all you have to go and do is go and configure it. So let's go and configure it. So we go to configuration, click on him, and we go, we want to add an SNMP IP port. So let's go and do that. So we go add, and we'll go just query, whatever's available. So what this will do is this will poll the network, and it will look for MAC addresses associated with various PowerShell SNMP cards. So I know I like this one here, so we'll take this guy here and we'll connect to him, 42, and we're done, okay? And we just do okay, and we'll just wait for it to connect. Host is trying to connect, and there we go. So now we're connected, all right? So all we have to do now is just set up what um, options we want for the safe shutdown. So let's go back to the configuration menu. Now that we know we're connected, to the SNMP card with this port address. Uh, and uh, so let's go and do that. All right, so we got configuration. So on this, on this IP port address, we can look at the power failure options. So if power fails coming from the wall socket, in, socket going into the UPS, then client mate will perform this action. So right, you can go to hibernation or you can perform shutdown. So let's do shutdown. So after AC fail for 10 minutes, the UPS will commence Safe shutdown. Now you can run other applications like down here if you wish, and you can go and browse what you want to do for different applications before you actually go into the, the full shutdown of your computer. But essentially, if you just leave the default like that and press OK, then when the computer experiences, uh, when the UPS experiences a power failure, well, in fact, I'll do it, right? So, so while I'm here, I've now disconnected the power from the UPS and it should show up in a minute. There you go. So you've got AC file. All right, so just move this out of the way here. So I'll press OK. And you've basically got 10 minutes and it's counting down now from 9 minutes and 51 seconds. And it'll just count down backwards until eventually it will get to the point where it'll perform a safe shutdown. So that's basically all you need to know. Now, if power is restored, from the utility at the wall socket to the UPS, you should see power come back. So AC is going normal. So now we're safe, okay? Uh, now, obviously you can go and look at the event log, which effectively summarizes what you just saw in this window here. And essentially client mates, if I just drop him down here, client mate will just run in the background, always ready to perform the safe shutdown of your computer uh, if the UPS loses input power uh, and it will automatically shut down very safely all your applications and then shut off your computer. Okay, so that's client mate. So I'll just drop that down. And thanks for watching this video.